they keep spamming Bong Cloud. Guys, it's not happening. All right. I, like, there is no. It's not gonna happen. And if it happens, I don't know. What do I do if it happens? Oh, it's on the board! <gasps> The bomb clad in the final round of the St. Louis Rapid and Play. No way, the man actually did it. I'm absolutely done. Anna, two times now you have tried to thank the chat for their wholesomeness, and Zoom just cuts you right off. They were like, no, we're not we're not having really? that right now. Yeah, it's so oh, crazy because no. you froze and you unfroze two seconds before it happened. Oh my goodness, the man actually Jeez. just played King E2. I'm done. <laughs> Everybody, collectively take a hit of your respective bunk cloud. It is actually happening. I can't believe it. This is one of the top events of the year, and Hikaru goes for his Twitch trademark, bunk cloud. I can't believe it. Oh my gosh. Aim high, baby. 78% in the poll. Ah, <sighs> it's MT. Oh my goodness. 97% of chat is rejoicing, 3% of the chess elitists are, could not be more angry. If we thought that hate viewing was at its peak throughout the tournament, it just be, those people are taking their shirt off. Magnus was putting it on to start, but they're, they're just ripping it straight off. Oh my goodness. He's uh, doing it for the fans. He's doing it for you guys. This is all for you. Hikaru playing a very dubious opening this is fine when he's playing against his uh, against his subs and viewers uh, with all respect uh, jeffrey jong has a bit higher rating than hikaru's usual opponents um, when it comes to playing on his streams so this is actually a huge risk when it comes to an elite tournament to go for king e2 on move two uh by the way meanwhile uh Carlson doesn't even go for the win. Uh, Magnus Carlson has drawn the game immediately, hmm. guaranteeing at least a shared split for first. So he's not even playing for a win. Uh, he did have the black pieces, but he's happy to make that draw. So I'm going to put Wesley so game at the bottom left. Wesley needs to win his game uh, to get shared first place. That is the current status. Okay, now chat, we need to move on to our next prediction. Are we actually... Uh, are we actually gonna get a win from Hikaru here? I mean, like, no way, right? <laughs> you can't, you, you can't, you can't, seriously. At least, like, in a three minute, no increment game, maybe, but is he actually going to win with the Bong Cloud too? Not just play it? I mean. <laughs> <laughs> in a five minute game with three second bonus, that is so much time. Like, if you lose, you lose, but. Gosh. I'm still in shock that he played the Bone Cloud and that he has a decent position out of the Bone Cloud. Well, decent it might be a little bit generous. Uh, you know, Jeffrey is is kind of he's kind of putting in the work here. His pieces are coming in from both sides. That eval bar is hydraulic pressing this position away. Oh my gosh, the man actually did it. That is, God, I'm, I'm scared. I'm scared, Anna, of my YouTube recap. The chess purists, there's a lot more chess purists on YouTube than on Twitch. That's why <laughs> Twitch is full of new happy chess fans. You know, and appreciate, obviously, everybody for all the gifted subs to Hikaru's channel. Uh, he doesn't see it right now, but he uh, he definitely will afterward. Man, uh, that's, that's just too much. That's just too funny. I, I'm so impressed. This, this is... The day started with Magnus Carlsen entering the game against Hikaru shirtless, and now Hikaru finishes with the bone clad. We've had so much action today. I wish every single tournament would feature these many storylines. This is this is an, uh, this is incredible. Um, yeah, obviously the the commentators of the of the main show. Between getting yelled TSM at them like five or six times in an interview and now the bomb cloud in the last round, they might they must be extremely confused. I know. <laughs> but I think they should be aware of the bomb cloud reference. They called right? it a mouse slip, Anna. What? No way. Oh my goodness. Come on, guys, you can't make chess commentators look like boomers to that extent. 
Come on. Okay, chat. No, chat's trolling no, me. I, I, that cannot be. I'm I'm sure they know the bonk that. This can It's Every one just... thing the TSM chant. They oh. uh, that was that was very recent. The Picker was signing with TSM and even even if uh, they knew about the sponsorship of course, but uh, they probably aren't aware of how esports events and TSM fans can be celebrating their players. Um but bon cloud. Chili Mo, appreciate it. Everybody's gifting five. Oh, this is uh this will be a fun way to end the tournament. And yeah. I look forward to chatting a little bit with Hikaru. <laughs> I can't wait for him to join us, guys. Don't go anywhere because he'll be with us after having finished this Bon Cloud game. And hopefully he will stream later today. It's been uh been rough for him to to kind of keep up the the pace the rampant pace that he's he's had uh he he is he's in a lot of trouble here i think the move knight to d3 basically wins the game uh i'm very yeah really worried about that knight d3 check you can't take you can't take the queen because you're pinned here jeffrey probably will play like bishop g2 king's not gonna get out anytime soon we don't have to show the full game but you know is Wesley crushing? I'm looking at the bottom left. Wesley does have a dominant position over Pintala Hare Krishna. That game for Wesley is worth $5,000. Yeah, and having that in mind, it's interesting that Magnus decided that the draw for him was alright against Krishna. Maybe he didn't think that Wesley had high winning chances with the black pieces. Or he doesn't mind that they will share first. Normally he wouldn't mind. Not for the price money, but I think more for more for the prestige and just, you know, winning it all, winning clear. So many people, meanwhile, are popping off with five gifted subs. I do very much appreciate it. I'm, I'm Thank just... Thank you so much for the huge support on Hikaru's channel. I'm just looking at Twitter and I, I don't see anything. I don't see anything about the Bond Cloud. I see all these tweets about, uh, you know, Magnus makes a draw against Grishuk. Dr uh, he gets clear first and he... Uh, all the, uh, wh wh where's the bon cloud tweet, huh? I think you should make one, Levy. You need to, you need to fill the void and and be the preacher of the bon cloud. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> In the meantime, I'm gonna give a shout out to Levy's channel again. He's aiming for a hundred k. Let's get it closer. I don't know how many followers you gained recently, Levy, but I hope you are getting closer to your dream number. 7777 is passed, but it can still be 100k. I myself am aiming for 50k. That's, that's how my channel size is. I'm a small creator, but I really appreciate all the support. You guys have been amazing. The hype train on Hikaru is not stopping. <laughs> Keep it going. Push the train. Keep yeah, pushing. By, by the way, Anna, uh, we, have a, we have Jeffrey just down a rook here. He sacrificed the rook, and I... What's going on? I thought the game was heading uh, in a very, very unfavorable way for um, for Hikaru. But yes, where is the rook and where is the compensation for it is a good question. There's your tweet. It's crazy that this man's not actually going to lose this game. <laughs> he played the bomb cloud. He played a bonk and I'm gonna retweet you by the way. I need oh, to. Retweet. Oh my god. <laughs> one day I will repay the favor, Anna. One, one day uh, <laughs> my, my baby social media accounts with their 2,400 followers on Instagram will, will return the favor. You'll love to see it. I cannot wait for the response of the angry chess fans who have nothing to gain or lose from these games sitting at home to go, it's so disrespectful. This is an abomination to our game. Let the man take a rip of his bong. Everybody chill out. That's the whole point of the bong club. Have you guys not <laughs> seen the thumbnails? This guy, uh... This guy made, a, made an entire YouTube series playing the bong cloud and made it to 3,000 blitz. Like, chill out. Yeah, it's crazy how Hikaru, from that terrible position, because once again, uh, with all due respect to the bong cloud, um, Hikaru was basically lost out of uh, the opening with that 93 check, but the Jeffrey went full on i'm gonna go for the kill sacrifice the rook and there was no kill hikaru defended precisely and now 
I think he probably can get even more. Imagine he wins in the final round with the Bone Cloud. Imagine he wins. I mean, that's just gross. <laughs> <laughs> like, the man... It, it, it's like, you know, you're going to fight and you have nothing to gain with a win. And, like, not even rating, because none of this is, yeah. is rated, right? And, um... Guys, uh, thank you. Yes, those of you that are, that are taking an interest in the thumbnail, I literally did just send a message uh, <laughs> to Carrie Bird. I do shout her out a lot on Twitter. If somebody needs graphics work, quick plug for her. She's great. Um, and also in every YouTube description. And I was like, yeah. yo, what's the progress of your thumbnail? Because can we add a bong to Hikaru? She was like... <laughs> she doesn't... She's not, she's, not, she's not too big on chess. She's big on graphics. And I was like, he played an opening called the Bong Cloud. So, um, yeah. Ikaro's trying to win this, and uh... I think he will. I, at this point, uh, he still has the extra rook on the board and his king is not getting mated. This is insane. Jeffrey has a lot of pawns, so he's had four extra pawns here. But Hikaru's looking to stabilize, the, but the, the annoying thing is that Jeffrey's his king is actually very solid. I love how we're actually going to do high-level analysis of a game that began E4, King E2. <laughs> I'm also taking a quick look at the West list that we have him on the smaller board. I think he will uh, win his game. He is doing very well against Hare Krishna still. And if he wins, he will tie for first together with Magnus Carlsen. While for Hikaru playing the Bonka in a top Grandmaster tournament. Yeah. Wow. Sorry, board is uh, is teleporting a little bit. I mean, it, the, the really hard thing about this position, though, on a serious note, when you're trying to win it, you can't move any pieces forward because your king is so weak. So you, you want to move pieces to the other side of the board. Hit this guy, hit over here. But everything for black is very well protected and his structure mm -hmm. is super solid. But yes, he, Hikaru is apparently winning in this position. And Wesley is also winning. Nepo beat Ferruja, by the way, so we can put that... Uh, we can put that uh, in the scoreboard that Nepo has finished the tournament on a positive note. Hiruja, uh, oh, Hiruja. Hiruja, unfortunately, losing his final round, but I hope to see that kid back, man. I hope to see him kick ass, seriously. He's so strong, and I mean, I'm looking forward to his next event. Yeah, but as I said um, in the interview, he did seem uh, really positive, even if the results are not going in his uh, way. And another thing he mentioned is that, yes, even the results, even though the results aren't what he would hope for, but he did feel good about his play in yesterday's Blitz uh, round, all the, I mean, the nine rounds, the entire day, basically. And that he was taking it as practice for his next event, which is Norway Chess. He will be playing in a month, less than a month, at the Atibox Norway Chess event, which is one of the few over-the-board tournaments, super tournaments, that will be held this year. I can't believe it. He's actually just completely... Yeah, Norway is going to be over the board. That's exciting, because Bundesliga is also going on right now. It's just cool to see over the board back and these guys yeah. playing, even if it is with plexiglass. I mean, I, if I have yeah. to play an over-the-board tournament with plexiglass, yeah. I don't know how I'm going to do. Wow. This is so crazy. Hikaru that completely winning, he can take on c7 and then try to hunt down that king on a6. Uh, extra rook, starting with the bone cloud. The bone cloud may be trending from this game on, on top level, because it has been trending, of course, uh, on Twitch and Among Us, right? But uh, maybe top grandmasters too will start copying Hikaru's recipe for success. Yeah, potentially. Potentially, I don't, I don't know. I don't know if they will or not. But Hikaru is actually going to convert this as long as he keeps his king safe. As long as he keeps his king safe. I'm, 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 I'm just watching. Sorry, and I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm just watching the reaction on, on Twitter. Uh, you know, chat. You guys, uh, those of you that popped over to uh, Twitter in the other tab, appreciate your, uh, <laughs> your positivity. <laughs> Wesley So has won, by the way. Wesley So has won, uh, and he's joined Magnus for shared first place, which is huge. Jeffrey Jean resigns. Or runs out of time, losing the bishop, and it is over. And Hikaru has actually won the game. He has won the game after starting with a bomb cloud. Um, I also got retweeted. <laughs> I got retweeted <laughs> by a grandmaster who was not happy with my tweet. He's like, "No, I actually can't say that I do like the bomb cloud being played." So the debate has begun. The <laughs> old guard versus the new guard. Oh man! I need to see that. I have retweeted you with that uh, a quote. This someone. <laughs> 
Oh, okay. I see. Yeah, your your tweet is very popular. <laughs> hey man, uh, what's up? Cool last game. What opening was that? I've never seen that before. <laughs> Why'd you move your king? Was that that was weird? That was a bad move. Yeah, I mean there there's nothing to play for really, so I just thought, well, who cares? Why not? Why not play it? Um, for for all the means. Oh, you okay. did it. We we were debating whether you will actually go for it. We had a poll on your channel. We were on the edge of our seats whether you would actually dare to play the bone cloud, and then you did it. And you won. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, it, I I think Jeffrey he tried to really just flat out refute it, and he got a great position. Um. But yeah, I think somewhere after I played Queen C4 when he played Bishop G2, he should have had some way to win on the spot. Um, I, I don't know what the win was, but there had to have been a forced win that he missed somewhere. Because he, he clearly blundered that I had on this, uh, when he played, this, after Queen H4, I think already it's so much better for Black. But you probably just have to go Bishop G7 and just kind of just positionally win the game. Um, because he just blundered that I had this Queen block after Queen F5, Queen H6. We didn't mm. see the exact yeah. moment. We were very worried about your position of the ninety three. Well, uh, well, I mean, it's not a good. <laughs> I, 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 like, I, no, no, no. <laughs> Anna was worried, and I was like, "Dude, I don't even care." Like ninety three. Like I remember at some point, Hikaru, I was like starting to give a sentence of real analysis, and then I'm like, Hold, "This game started e four king e two." Like I don't really. But then it got you started consolidating, and it was it was good, and then chat was getting hyped and. Yeah, um, I mean, I figured if if, we, if time started winding down and I wasn't just force loss where there wasn't like a straightforward uh, like two or three move tactic that wins, then um that, then I assumed that there it was still complicated. But yeah, I was just, I mean, there was nothing to play for. I, I third place locked up. I couldn't. I had not. I mean, there's no way I could get the second. So I I just figured why not have some fun. Uh, Magnus in the final game by here we um, go. Now is a good time, right? Against, um his uh, Olympic teammate, Jeffrey Zhang, uh, he opened with e uh, Well, first of all, actually, that's a little bit odd. I don't think Jeffrey is on the Olympiad team, first of all. So that's, that's, uh, Jennifer is a little bit confused about that, actually, because um, I think the team as it stands right now is it's it's uh, Fabiano, Lenny, Wesley, myself, and Sam Shanklin. So that's a little bit... I don't think that's actually correct. But anyway, we'll watch the fun stuff now. I P E 2 um, a.k.a. the Bond Cloud. What would you have done against that opening? Well, that's a bit confusing to me. I always thought F3, King, F2 was the real, was the real bone cloud. And he's totally trolling. Oh my god, he's totally trolling. Like, F no, because F3, King, F2 is actually, the it's like the fret or something. Like, E4, King, E2 is the bond cloud. F3, King, F2 is the fret, although I did do it in my speed run. So Magnus might have actually watched my speed run. But, but at any rate, it's all kind of the same kind of junk. Variations of, of that, like... <laughs> Um, the most conservative is obviously just to continue playing normally after this, but there are other variants like going C3, um, C3, C3, Queen E1, then, no, C3, F3. I'm just going to stop this for one second, you guys, be because what's great about this is that he's totally trolling. Like, he's super, st he's like super, he's super serious, but he's 100% trolling here, and I'm not sure the commentators actually get that. King F2, King E3, King D, D3, uh, King E3, King D3, King, King C2, Queen E1, King D1. <laughs> and uh, there's the other one where you go, that's, this is obviously uh, very, very bad. And uh, there's the other one where you go, um, <laughs> where you go, um, let's say F3, C3, and then Queen A4. Uh-huh, yeah. Uh, queen f4, queen h4, then king d1, king e1. Um... <laughs> Knight f6, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, now that... Yeah, you, you don't want to hang your So, head. I don't know. I, I, I... Maybe there are... Um... Uh, maybe sort of... These traditions are, are different in Norway than they are in... In, um, in in the United States, but I, I felt like what he did was not a was not a proper proper bon bonfire opening. But the fact that he played it and, and won with it is still is still pretty uh, pretty cool. And uh, I think in, in the last round, um, yeah, um, it's um, it, it's uh, I think it would be 
uh, fun regardless. But obviously, when he when he um, when he wins, um, that's um, it looks it looks a lot better, right? And um, mm. for True. for Jeffrey, obviously, that's that's an embarrassment. But <laughs> it's just one game, and um, it's it's not like oh my god, it's not like you don't have to play well to win after King E two. You still you still have to play a good game, and um, uh, I guess um, I guess Hikaru um, eventually tricked him. Mm -hmm. Magnus, it's, I'm sure the people in the audience are thinking the world champion of chess studies these games <laughs> too. Like, you actually look at this stuff. No, there's there's more, you know. Uh, <laughs> there's more. yeah, there's e4 f5. Uh, there's e4 f5, and then e f5, uh, king f7, mm -hmm. queen h5, g6 takes king g7 and so on yeah yeah there's uh, this line too yeah true yeah queen g5 yeah, king f7 rook or rook h7 you go rook h7 then then, then you hide on uh then you mm -hmm. hide on h8 and you play bishop h6 and rook so g7 and you keep line. going let on let me yeah. show you a version that's a lot better so <laughs> a lot better <laughs> we're getting access <laughs> to magnus carlson's secret <laughs> opening files yes absolutely e e force e5 uh f e e5 f4. yes f4 e f4 f4 uh, knight c3 knight c3 queen h4 uh king e2 ah this no, one G3. yeah yeah this what one this is true about? this this one's playable uh, too queen, queen e7 mm -hmm. queen e7 yeah queen e7 yeah this is theory here. This is actually and now theory. You can go king f2. And queen h4. King f2, right? uh, queen h4 and uh, g3. And now you get a an excellent version of this stuff. Ah, this one I <laughs> this one I'm not super sure. familiar In with. You're too tempted up. And this is this is not lost, I think. <laughs> oh my gosh. This yeah, wow. this one is actually quite interesting. To have this kind of preparation of with with every line possible. <laughs> so you would have been ready for Nakamura's bomb cloud. Uh, yeah, I probably, I probably would have gone King E seven to be fair. <laughs> <laughs> and then, then he goes King E one. <laughs> I go King E eight, and we basically play no castling. Chess. Right. This is this is the uh, this is the other part. Yeah, yeah, you exactly. Like no yeah, chess. yeah. Yeah, I I, I kind of like it. It's 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 pretty good.